everybody, it's your girl Lala, it's your girl Lala, and I'm back on your phone, your TV, your tablet, your desktop, your laptop, whatever it is that you're watching me on. I'm super excited because I think I'm like the only person that does their makeup that doesn't own, well that didn't own previously, anything from BH Cosmetics. So when I seen that they was having the Black Friday sale, I was like, oh. Let me go ahead and sneak me some stuff up in this cart real quick and check out, you feel me? If y'all want to see what I got from the Black Friday sale, then go ahead and stay tuned, continue to watch. But don't forget to comment down below, share, like, subscribe, put on the notification bell so you can be alerted every time I upload a new video. And let's go. First thing I want to talk about that I got is going to be this bronzer. I got it in the color Coco Cutie. Yes, I did already use this stuff about three hours ago to create this look right here. If y'all wanna see it, I will put the link down below in the description box so you can go ahead and check it out and see how, you know, I got this look and what I thought about the products. But yes, yeah, so I got this beautiful bronzer. I've never used a bronzer before and I figured why not grab this one, I will put the prices somewhere on the screen because I really don't remember how much it costs, but I know it's cheap AF, okay? Next thing is going to be the, okay. It's gonna be the BH Cosmetics Ultimate Artistry Shadow Palette. I kinda like this, it's really sleek. It looks like, you know, Kind of expensive even though it wasn't. Now let's might as well go ahead and just show y'all what the palette looked like. Even though I'm pretty sure it's been out for a while. But it's okay because it's new to me. We got, this is the palette. And I must say I am loving it because lately I've just been really into colorful palettes. Trying to step my eyeshadow game up. And I must say that this palette is the bomb.diggity.com. I'm just gonna, I'm not gonna swatch the colors that I have on my eyes because I want y'all to see, you know all that stuff in the video of me doing my makeup. But I will swatch a couple of these shimmers and a few other colors. This blue right here, this one, and that is, ooh, those are pretty. Pretty, 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 pretty. Let's go ahead and try a few of these mattes. Cause y'all know shimmers, it's easy to sparkle up a shimmer, but with the mattes, it's like, mm, I don't know. So let's go ahead, we are gonna check out this green down here. Mm-hmm. And then we gonna check out, hmm. It's not really a lot of matte, but we gonna do this green right here, and then we gonna do this blue over here in the corner. And that is what those are looking like. So, I mean, from the finger to my lid, I do wanna go ahead and swatch one more thing, and that is this, like, green color right here. I feel like it's gonna be really pretty. So let's just go ahead and throw that on in there and voila, I'm telling y'all, if y'all need a if y'all need a new palette, you've been looking for some colors, I'm telling y'all this palette, hey, give it a try. Next thing that I want to go ahead and tell y'all about is going to be the white concealer that I got. The reason that I got white is so that I could make, use it for like my lids and try to make my eyeshadow pop a little bit more because normally when I use colorful palettes, it's really, really hard for them to show up on my lid the way that I want them to show up. So I always end up having to like, you know, sacrifice some of the pigment because it just never shows up the way that I want it to show up. It literally says white on the bottom of it, it's just a white concealer. It also said on the website that you can mix it with um, like foundation if you want to make it brighter or like lighter. It might be a little bit too dark for you, but then the lighter shade might be a little bit too light. You want to like even it out, get your perfect skin tone. You can definitely do that. BH Metal Liquid Lipstick. As you can see, I have already swatched it on the back of my hand and it looks bomb. I got this because I just really wanted to like be out of the box and you know, like step out of my comfort zone and I was like you know what let me go ahead and get this and I'm so glad that I did because it's bomb like it ain't going nowhere so it's not spreading so you know when they say matte 
it's mad like it's sticking sis it's sticking it's super super pretty because it has like a gold sparkly kind of um tint to it so i can't wait to use the 14 piece bh chic brush set okay and it came in this right here well it came in a box but i kind of ripped it um yeah it had this in it which is very cute there's a lot of space in here so you can put other stuff in it as well. This will be a cute makeup bag if you're going to travel and you can't, you know, you can't bring all of your makeup. Like you just put the necessities in there and hit the roll. Skr, skr. These are all of the brushes. If you guys want to know how they work and how they perform and if they're good quality, then go ahead. Like I said earlier, go ahead and hit the description and you will find the link to my tutorial video okay and i also got the foundations i got two because i just couldn't find my like i couldn't really tell if a certain shade was my color when it came to the concealers so what i did was i got the two shades that looked closest to me in the foundation and i just figured whichever one fit me i would use the lighter one as my concealer or if the lighter one was my color, I would use the darker one, maybe as like contour, something like that. Is that these last for 12 months? So, worst came to worst, I could have just saved whatever one might have been too dark and used it in the summertime. Summer's coming up, I just got this. It'll still be good by then. I got the shades Warm Chestnut and Deep Cocoa. Go check that video out. I'm telling y'all, it's bomb. Went ahead and I picked up this Opalusion um, Mystic like bundle type of thing. And what it comes with is it comes with this holographic cosmetic bag. It has the 16 color Illusion eyeshadow palette. Um, it came with a liquid eyeliner and a large shader brush. Okay, eyeliner that comes in it. It's just regular black um, and then it has this shader brush that they were talking about like I said this is the bag I don't know why they put this tissue thing in here but who cares is the palette the illusion palette that um, came with it as well and we're just gonna slide that bad boy right on out of there and go ahead and lift this up so we can show you guys what it looks like super 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 pretty super cute oh my god i love this column right here this is like speaking to me it's calling my name i love that red down there that orange like oh my god i'm gonna have so 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 much fun with this palette so that is the end of my bh cosmetics black friday haul if you guys you know want to see me do some looks with this even though I already did one with the artistry palette but if y'all want to see me do more looks like I don't know just let me know what y'all want to see me do down below in the comment section because sometimes I be lost like I don't be knowing what y'all be wanting to see I don't I don't know y'all I don't know oh I'm steady talking I forgot to show y'all I forgot I even got this cuz I don't even be wearing stuff like this I got these long ass lashes okay I don't know what made me get these but I was like you know what Maybe one day I might want to be dramatic AF and I'm going to need them. So I got them. They made the packaging look real pretty. You know, the lashes are all fluttery like a butterfly. Like I just was like, you know what? Let me go ahead and grab some of these because I feel like every female should have a pair of dramatic ass lashes. As you guys can see, I was talking pretty fast. I'm trying to hurry up because I really don't want to feel like I've been talking too long. So with that being said... <laughs> Make sure to mind the business that pays you, okay? If you ain't making money off of it, if you ain't benefit benefiting from it, if it ain't helping your progress, okay? Mind your business, okay? Stay out of it. Only mind the business that pays you. And I will see y'all in the next one. Peace.